Hey guys, just wanted to do another update here on the tomatoes. Gave an update on the peppers, so uh, here is the update on the tomatoes. So we've got our yellow pears here. And I'll sit down and I will say I did try doing an update on them a while ago. So they probably look a lot bigger than the last time you've seen them. But the last update I did got on my phone and uh, something was up with my iTunes or uh, download on my computer no big deal so as you can see uh, the tomatoes are looking really good let me put this right here for you so you can see just how big they're getting uh, let's see here this might work if not no big deal so we'll go right here As you can see, the tomatoes are getting taller. Uh, about two and a half feet now. Uh, some of them three foot, so they're getting bigger. Excited about that. And uh, even more exciting is if we come right here, you can see uh, we're getting tomatoes here. Uh, no tomatoes yet but uh, definitely blossoms and the flowers are a great sign. I just fertilized everything yesterday, so uh, everything should be looking pretty good. These guys, these yellow pears here, are getting pretty tall. And you can see some of them, the roots are okay. This guy branched off quite a bit, not too picky about it. And these guys looking pretty good. I'll go down the line here. Oh, and here's some more some more flowers so uh, looking good and this is a sweet aroma so a little bit more of a juicier uh, aroma type tomato as you can see these guys are growing up here pretty big i need to put some more some more bands on there because they are <laughs> they're outgrowing them and my best looking tomato right now uh, when it comes to growth is this independence day i mean this guy is i had to put a new a new stake in there you can see because he is just growing. He is over three foot tall now. No flowers yet, but uh, looking healthier. And man, I'm gonna let him keep growing, getting up there nice and tall, and then we'll get some we'll get some maters off of him sooner or later. Uh, some super sweets. They're looking pretty good. And then this I had to replant. This is not a super sweet now. Couldn't even tell you. I had to replant this pot so many times. But the guy I got in there is looking pretty good. Some romas. Looking good. And we got some more Romas. Now these guys, um, this, these guys will be pretty soon here. We'll see some some peppers, or some, some tomatoes, sorry. But you see this guy's kind of interesting. Pretty thick base, and it kind of skinnies off up here. And then he's getting nice and thick up here, so. Not exactly sure the reasoning, but I'm not gonna complain. We got tomatoes and they're, they're growing. And we got some San Marzans here. These ones took a while to get off the ground going, but they're looking a lot better now. I'm pretty happy with those. And I'll give a little back up here so you can see how everything is looking. I'll come down here. I will say that you know what? These tomatoes this year, man, they are compared to last year. Uh, last year, sorry, the mosquitoes are out, but last year I would say that. Uh, my biggest plant was probably this tall and as I've kind of mentioned in the past videos I didn't do the greatest job um, acclimating them getting them ready or even starting them so last year was kind of a fluke but hey this year man we are just three-fourths of the way done with June and I've already got tomatoes three foot tall I'm definitely happy with that we'll be expecting another update here soon because how these guys are looking we'll be having tomatoes here in no time so again just an update on my tomatoes gave an update on the peppers a little bit ago but I'll come back here and so you can see and again like always just kind of showing uh, we're right here in the middle of the city so you can you know get your bucket set up you know get your seeds going and uh, watch them grow doesn't matter where you're at so for Gabriel Miller this was an update on the tomatoes. Till next time.